So, I got a van. Hello everyone, today's video is going to be exactly what the title says, my van build. So I'm going to be uploading this to both my, not my channel and my personal channel. So if you're not subscribed to my personal channel, make sure you head over there because all the future updates on the van will be uploaded there. I'm going to send you back a couple of months when I made my first small video about the van before I started work on it. So welcome back to another video. Uh, this is on my personal channel and this is my beautiful van that I purchased a, a couple of months ago. There's maybe two months ago, two, three months ago, uh, off eBay. So I've always wanted to convert a camper van. I've always wanted to, to c make a project that I could go traveling around in, um, being a nomad and all. So I bought this beauty um, and I've decided to completely convert it and take the dog on amazing trip. So let me give you the grand tour of this 2008 Volkswagen Crafter. So it's pretty much, an old work van so it, it, it needs a lot of work done to it um, so the plan is to kind of rip everything out insulate the whole thing uh, and then i'm gonna put a bed here it's gonna be a solid bed a little booth with two seats here and then possibly a little kitchenette here i haven't completely decided everything where everything's gonna go I know that, yeah, that door doesn't work. Um, I haven't decided where everything's gonna go yet, but I know that it's gonna be a fun project to do and I'm gonna document it on this channel. Maybe not so much as a complete step-by-step -step how to, but just so you guys can see the progress of this of this project coming along. So, you know, it's, it's not in perfect condition and I thought it would be a good kind of van to do this project on, uh, on a budget, because I spent just over 3,000 pounds on it. Um, has pretty good mileage and history so yeah let me show you the outside so first things first is it has a lot of damage to the door uh, and then all the way around you have like little rust spots and stuff like that so i'm gonna completely redo that i've bought new doors which you might have seen on other videos inside so i'm gonna change this door and the driver's door uh, and then these tires are going to get changed into all terrain tires. So yeah, this is the first look at my special project, which has kind of been sitting around while I've still been doing all the other work in the studio. Um, and this is it. Yeah. So back to my vlog. So there we have it, the start of my van life journey. And I'd originally planned to document every step of the way, but there were so many incredible videos on YouTube already. I thought it was pointless making more step-by-steps, especially when my work is not as good as some of those tutorials. So I've been working on the van every chance I've got, and so far it's been a nice gradual build. I started off by swapping over the sliding door on one of the rear doors as they had so much unrepairable rust and dents. That was a process as most of the screws holding the door in place had rusted over, so I had to actually angle grind some of them out. I then moved on to getting rid of all the rotted plywood and the divider behind the seats. There was literally years and years of dust and filth underneath the wood, so it took a good while to give it a good clean out. I then got to work on jet washing it out and then wiping off any dirt I could find, followed by treating and neutralizing the rust and giving it a small primer with spray paint. I'm planning on giving it all a fresh coat of hammerite again soon. Myself and my friend Niall, who was getting his hair cut in my last upload, sanded the outside of the van. I then neutralized any rust and gave it a primer of spray paint and then spray painted all of the plastics to prep for the painting of the van. So using rollers and military vehicle paint, I give the outside of the van four coats of dark gray and I give it another further coat of since I scratched it, installing the windows and cutting holes in the panels. So this was my next step. I then cut out and installed three windows in the van to add light and ventilation. These come in easy to do kits. All you need is a jigsaw and an angle grinder to cut the holes out and then install them yourself. I then followed this up with installing a Maxi Fan Deluxe in the van and a Fiamma seal and vent for extra ventilation. And this is where I'm up to so far. So let me take you to the van and give you a tour on where I'm up to and what my plans are going forward.
So this is my 2008 Volkswagen Crafter. As you can see, this is where I put one of the side windows in. I put another smaller window over here. Bring you around to the back. Another window on this side, as you can see. Get good ventilation. I spray painted them black just as a budget uh, option. I'm gonna put all-terrain tires on there, like I've said in the video already painted all this but I need to redo the plastics again and then there's some dents on the side um, and I need to go over again where I've scratched some of the paintwork and then I'll give you a little tour on the inside so this is where I ripped out the divider window 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 not the neatest job on the window so don't use me as a point of reference on how to do your windows in vans that's a new door as you can see it's a completely different color to that one and then this is the door i changed as you have seen in the video these are the vents that i've installed so this just opens up it has like a mosquito like insect and then on this side that goes in once i've carded it all again this is like an extractor so the bed is essentially going to come up to about here it's going to be a double bed as wide as possible i'm not going to clad these parts i'm just going to do like a thin insulation um, just so i can keep it as wide as possible because the bed is going to go lengthways uh, so yeah this is where i'm up to so far i'm going to give it another coat of paint all the way through just to coat any rust um, just clean it up and just so i'm starting on, on a, a good note and don't have to go back and do anything later on like all these bits of like rust and stuff um, got to still seal those little holes in the van where the, the plastic clips in um, but yeah that's that's a lot of the outside done um, so it's a process in itself uh, I feel like I've got a good handle on DIY type of stuff and now I've you know worked on the shops done the yoga studio and then worked on the studio in here myself so it's been a full project like I said earlier I didn't want to do a full step-by-step -step tutorial because um, there's so many good tutorials on YouTube that you'd be looking at me and, and doing it wrong probably so uh, I'll probably kind of keep people up to date on this personal on the personal channel even though I'm uploading this video to both channels um, so if you want to check any more of the van uh, or see me going on little trips with the van then probably best going over and uh, subscribing to my other channel so if you're on my normal channel right now you'll see the link in the description and if you don't subscribe to my normal channel on me you're on my personal channel bit mad but the link will also be in the description so yeah i'm gonna use this van i'm gonna go on little hikes i'm gonna take the dog uh do little trips around the uk um because obviously being in lockdown and traveling quite a lot i've realized that i miss it quite a lot so I'm going to take this opportunity to you know go to some of the places in the uk that i've not been to like some of the parts of scotland some places on the south coast and yeah just just getting away as much as possible doing some hikes and maybe filming it uh so yeah if you want to keep up to date and uh, follow me on this channel go subscribe to the best not channel i guess um so yeah thank you for watching this video and checking out my fan updates and this is why i've been a bit lackluster with with uploads on my personal channel because i've been busy not only with the shops reopening but uh working on a van build so yeah this is me thank you so much